Well, good afternoon and welcome to the uh, centre of Chester. We have a very special event going on here today and to tell us all about it is Lindsay Green. Lindsay, welcome to Chester. What's happening here today? Uh, well, we're part of Engage, which is a group of young people coming together all over the city from different churches and they're placed in different parts of the city doing different projects. So we're today just asking people what they'd like prayer for and we're drawing up kind of something to do with what they've said. So it can be asking for something or thanking God for something. Um, we're just kind of show people a different way of doing prayer today. And what response have you had from the general public? Um, quite positive. You can see the board that we've done here and there's another one round there. That, so quite a few people have told us what they'd like prayer for. Now you've got a lot of children painting here today. Uh, what sort of talent have they got? Uh, well, different ones. I don't know all of them very well. So um, some of them have been painting, others have been talking to the public, um, getting to know them and just seeing what they're doing. Um, some of them are face painting down at the river and doing puppets. So they've all got different talents and will be able to do different projects, I suppose, better than others. And whereabouts, uh, where else can people see this project happening? Uh, there's some down by the river and there's some in the town hall in, in the centre of Chester. Uh, some in Tarpoli and some in Newtown as well, but a lot of them are in the centre of Chester in different areas. Now you said that people are asking you to paint for a prayer, is that right? Yep. What sort of things are people asking you to paint in general and what sort of prayers, especially with the moment with the famine going on and yeah. this terrible, terrible thing abroad, uh, what sort of things are they asking you to pray for? Yeah, like you say, a lot of them are um, abroad. You can see different flags that we've um, drawn. This one I think is about rain in Africa and uh, the Norway incident that's been going on. And then a lot of people have been asking for um, their family, so specific people in their family. A few people um, have asking for people that have died and just kind of help to get through that um, kind of situation. So a lot of them are personal about people and then a lot of them are, like you say, abroad and, and different people in, the, in other countries. Now, religion's a very controversial subject today, especially amongst the young, and their belief is uh, slowly waning away, it's more pop music now. How do you find today that the youngsters have responded to you? And um, the young people that are working with us? Yes. Um, well, very well. They're from different churches around Chester, so most of the young people that have got the blue T-shirts are Christians. Some of them um, aren't, or some of them are learning, or some of them just go to church, uh, maybe because their parents do. But... Um, I suppose part of Engage is to show that young people uh, do have faith and, uh, and some of them are Christians and actually they, they can do positive things as well. That it's not, They're not just like hanging out on street corners and misbehaving but actually they can do a lot of positive stuff for their community. Now religion covers a vast amount of things, the Church of England, the Catholic Church, Muslims, um, Jewish religion. What religions have you had to hear today? Um, well, we're um, part of the Christian community, so um, the churches that are represented are different, different Christian churches, so evangelical churches, Baptist churches, Church of England, um, different ones, but all, all Christian uh, young people and leaders coming together, churches together from Chester and Tarpley. And what do you think this is doing for the young children that you've got here today? Is it enhancing their religious beliefs as well as increasing their painting skills? Yeah, hopefully. Um, what they do, they do a community action project in the day, so like this painting or um, uh, face painting and stuff like that. And then in the evening time, we're at Northgate Church and they have like a meeting together. So that is where, well, apart from in the day, that's where we hope that they'll get maybe closer to God and, like you say, enhance their faith, maybe learn a bit more um, about who God is and who they are as well. And um, yeah. Well, thank you for spending the time talking to us. Thank we'll you. film a bit of the painting, so thank you again. Okay, then. Great.